Welcome back. Dave Tile here for the New School. Uh, today's quick tip is on a function called revert to saved. Now, every once in a while, you might do something that is not what's known as an undoable function, uh, like deleting tracks. So I've got this enormous session in front of me. It's 40-something minutes long. I've been working on it for hours. Um, and let's say I accidentally highlighted these tracks from here to here, and I right-click and I hit delete. Pro Tools is trying to warn me. It's saying, hey, uh, you've got active clips found <clears throat> on all of these 19 tracks. Uh, are you sure you want to do that? Let's say I continue with my mistake here and I actually do hit delete. And then only after I hit delete, come on. Did I not, oh, there it goes. Only after I hit delete do I realize, oh no, I just got rid of a ton of my work. Not good. I cannot hit undo at this point. It's not an undoable function. But what I can do is come up here to file and hit revert to saved. Uh, there's no shortcut for it, um, probably because you don't want to accidentally do that unless you really mean to, but I'm gonna click revert to saved. Now let's just see what happens. Boom, it says you're gonna revert to the last saved version of the new school tutorial. Do you want to do that? Yes, please revert, save my butt and get those tracks back. It closes the session and it reopens the session to the last point where I saved it. Phew, that was really cheesy, whatever. Uh, Dave Tayo for the new school, thanks for watching.